Hi Libra, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. This will go from June 16th through the 22nd. Uh, thank you for tuning in. Thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Uh, continue to do so. Um, also, if you feel like this resonates with you, uh, click the extended reading. Or you can always uh, purchase the one question, one concern, three card reading. Okay. All links are below. Let's get into it. So, Libra. Um, definitely at a crossroads, especially in love and career. So, I've got how your partner feels. Do not mind my nails. I'm going to go get them done. Um, okay. Um, and then how you feel. Okay. Uh, you and your partner got some of the same cards. Uh, yet the lovers in the exact same position right here so um, get the hierophant and then your partner has the hierophant under the deck okay. so how your partner feels or maybe this is the energy of your partner if it resonates it resonates if it doesn't it's okay um this could be you could be married to this person or in a, in a long-standing commitment this is a committed man he could be a bit older or at least established in, in every facet so you know you you'll know your your partner he's um he could be a virgo if not a Virgo, um, definitely puts a lot of work in at his job or his career or his business. Or he's, you know, he or she is very hands-on. I have to say he, this is a lot of masculine energy. That three masculine cards out of six cards. Um, so Libra, yeah. Uh, King of Cups, the Emperor, Eight of Pentacles, the Lovers, Nine of Pentacles, Will of Fortune for your partner. Your partner feels like they're at a crossroads in regards to making a choice or the choice. Maybe between you and another, another person, another job, another home, or whatever. You fill in the blank. But most times it's another person. But we're just going to leave it, leave room for whatever's going on in your life. Um. They're very much concerned about their reputation, their reputation, their their um, how they come off uh, to the world. Um, their fatherly, manly, masculine energy or duties. Here, this is a person who's concerned about this. They're also concerned about uh, the merging or the division of of finances, of everything that comes with that taxes, loans, properties. Um, just shared resources all together. They understand that if they make the choice that, you know, that's going to play a, a significant part in, in their overall financial scope. Okay. Um, they understand that they have to make a choice. These cards do not indicate a choice being made because they're there's no wands here, but your partner, your person is at a place of knowing. I know that I need to make a choice. Okay. Um, it could be between you, Libra, and another person. Someone who is single, um, established, um, likes luxury, is um, well-traveled. Cross, yeah, cross cultural. Um, you know, the, they've gained enough wisdom in their own life where they have their own personal philosophy, right? This could be, and this person is not paying your partner much attention, not right now. They they could be separated because the leap, because either leap or the person you're dealing with, they have they have a lot to think about. They have a, a, a huge choice to make. Okay. Um, the reason why they could not be making the choice is because of these shared resources. Um, 
shit. This person is looking at their resources and saying, can I even, no, this is toward you, Libra, then it's, can I even partner with the Libra? Um, very much attracted to the Libra in every way. And, and they're the ideal mate, but uh, I still have duties and obligations in regards to family, home, children, um, some masculine type of duties or energy, fatherly duties. So that's weighing on them too. So that may be why they haven't actually made them the choice yet. Libra, how you feel about this situation is that you have an inner knowing. Um, you may need to go get, you may either give really good advice, wisdom, or you need to, you need to get some from some, some womanly advice. Speak to some woman that you trust. You feel like this is a spiritual connection. You feel like there has been a lot of drama and games played and there's been childlike behavior here also um, either in this long-standing relationship or marriage either somebody you're dealing with is married or you're married uh, the, the, the dynamics can just shift so you guys do that um, the Libra may be giving ultimatum to someone they want the truth about this choice right who are you choosing? I know about these, this other woman or man. Uh, which way are you going? It, you know, until you decide, I'm going to separate myself from from this. The Libra might be saying this to another. So I can't afford to be involved in this drama. It is um, making me. Um, feel off kilter so the Libra may be separating themselves from someone who needs to clearly make a decision about which way they're going the Libra also may this also may be a Libra who is making a, a, a career decision to do something that they actually love um, or um, something that's going to bring them a lot of money what do I do do something I love something that's going to bring me a lot of money um, they have to yeah it's a choice here not saying that this other way will disappear forever but right now you have to make the choice uh, the Libra may be searching for answers outside of themselves it says that you uh, you ultimately know you know which way to go self-reflection and you know the answer you're looking for someone to validate what you or how you think there may be opportunity for you to study under somebody that you that knows more than you also this may be some type of spiritual practice that turns into a business there needs to be some grounding here and there needs to be some rule and regimen and the Libra is without them. If this is business. Uh, it says once you get to a place of making the actual choice. The commitment. Because there's fear of committing to one way. The, the Libra is uh, okay with dividing themselves. Um, giving to two very real options. But it says you'll get what you feel you are without nine of cups what you what you wish for if you make the decision excuse me if you make the commitment to one path it doesn't say that this other path will be gone forever it just says that you need to come you need to commit to one path because spirit can't you frustrate in spirit now um lots of spiritual protection here but at the same time it's um spirit wants to bring in the the flood the the the, the overflow but they don't know which which way to bring the overflow and and it 
out of spirits is not going to divide the overflow amongst two things that you're giving to or that you're doing you need to decide and then they 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 open up the gates so it's up to you what you want to do and what you want to commit to you have like like talents hidden talents or something you do something you create some abilities that you've repressed that they're coming out now they want to be on display now uh, but you are not committing to it yeah fear of commitment here and, and therefore there's someone also fear of committing to a new way of living too if someone makes the choice to not choose you because this is about money too and habits uh, and material possessions if someone doesn't choose you you have a fear that you'll never have those things again or you'll never be able to acquire them or you're concerned more about what people will think or what they're looking at in that regard but you can't be concerned with that um, since you need to put some energy and effort into you okay so we are going to go over you know what no I don't really have time to do an extended read do I okay I'll do an extended read um just going to clarify what's going on for the Libra and maybe what the decision will be here for or what the choice will be here for your partner let's see somebody's staying out of obligation and fear of, of retribution or, or being ostracized or blackballed about you know leaving a family it's unlikely I hate this card I'm sorry <laughs> I didn't mean to say that but it's true I hate it because you just you just can't ever really pinpoint it you've got to let go somebody is trying to control a situation or hold on for dear life due to fear unlikely so I have to clarify unlikely because I don't know what unlikely is and that's why I don't like this card something is unlikely what is unlikely for the Libra okay you know what I'm just going to do the extended read now here Feel free to tip. You can always, you can send a dollar tip or whatever. It doesn't matter. Feel free. Because you're getting the extended read now. Because I really have so much to do today. And I just can't do extended reads. I'm sorry. Unlikely. Unlikely. Two one. Once again, habit, habits, money, material possessions, habitually, money, ethics, no, and, and fear, it's unlikely. One more card. You see why I don't like this card? Mm -hmm. Something about somebody changing their entire life. It's a it's it scares a person shitless because it's about money. Assets and the division of the hangman. Someone has to see something from a different perspective.
clarity and enlightenment comes to those who back away from the situation and think about it logically and rationally do what's best for everyone involved in the situation especially you Libra unlikely that someone will move this might be you Libra at the it's unlikely that someone will let me look at this one piece of information I have Ugh. because it is unlikely that someone will uh, let's see. Okay, so once again, back to this whole spiritual journey here that we talked about with the high priestess and the hierophant here. You had to give up something that you actually really, that you found value in. Back to these people who are here for career. And or some of you are going to have to give up a marriage that brought you a lot of material possession here. Uh, and it may be stalled for right now. Well, you're going to have to get clear and true about yourself and about doing for self and, and perspective and experience. She has a lot of experience. She's been through the good and the bad. And, and then she makes better decisions. Uh, she's logical, truthful about where she's landed herself. There might be a, a cutting away of, of of some old dynamic. It's unlikely that you're going to take all of this money with you in a divorce or separation yeah you you're going through like a complete metamorphosis transformation your life will look different but maybe you are only in something because of how it looked the status the money what this situation could afford you and not there for a uh, more spiritually grounded reason and that's why you have to take some time and, and move away yeah ace of wands i'm gonna start something new too this talks about health wills and happiness for self judgment the past look the present is here and it is what it is and the past is trying to it still has its hold on you, but you, you, you're coming out of it. Definitely, if you choose to let go, relinquish the past and the control, and know that better is coming for you. Once again, the Emperor. This has things to do with what you've built, what you felt was stable, what you, what you felt was um, grounded. It's not anymore. Something... Or, is changing someone wants something else you want something else there's a holding on out of obligation and money and assets and people are staying together in regards to you know the tangible versus the intangible that's pretty much what it looks like here 
and for some of you here on you've been on some spiritual path you're doing very good now you have to commit to it, it says if you commit to it you get you might be your own boss here with these two the aces and, and then the emperor um heaven will bring if you believe in heaven whatever you believe in the floodgates will open for you but right now you you just do you do both whatever that may be and you haven't committed to a particular way so libra this is your reading it says commit to uh, starting something new and then it's for some of you it's about letting go and starting over and starting a new seeing something from a different perspective um, so what you divorced and you used to drive a Maserati now you have to drive a Mercedes okay move on um, find true happiness in you these cards keep leading back to you and you getting clear about you. Um, let me leave you with some butterfly oracle cards. What is this about for the Libra? Wow. Leaving. Yeah. I knew it. Leaving old stuff behind like leave it leave it. it's not working it's not working someone doesn't want you anymore you don't want this person but you know that you're scared to be without them because of financial matters and they're scared to leave you because they think you're going to take them to the cleaners or vice versa or someone's scared to partner with you Libra because they, they don't have all of their ducks in a row and they have a lot of obligation some of some of you dealing with somebody who has several women who they, who they have children with <clears throat> the several baby mamas the modern day polygamy is basically what it is um and and they have a lot of obligation and you're even telling them wow finances i can't make this stuff up Libra. Uh, you're even telling them look you have to get your stuff together because I'm not taking on all this burden and uh, you also can't have access to me and all of these women you're gonna have to choose you have to make the choice changing your mind yeah body changes all right Libra okay Pretty self-explanatory for these two. You changing your mind about that newfound perspective with that hangman. You know what? I could do it by myself. You don't want to be with me. That's okay. Or vice versa. I don't want to be with you. That's okay. I'm going to figure this out. But I can no longer live in unhappiness, drama, and absolute craziness. You know, so... Libra, best wishes to you. Request a personal reading, even if it's, you know, one of the um, shorter reads or whatnot. Make sure you're using the coupon code below to receive $10 off any reading, $35 or more. Uh, especially if you feel like you're at a crossroads in regards to career and finance or at a crossroads in a relationship. Libra, I'm wishing you the best tips are appreciated because uh, there will be no extended read this is the extended read so um, you can always just go over to PayPal and send whatever or um, I think the uh, GoFundMe is below also if you want to whatever I don't know send me an email and say I would like to send you a tip how do I do that because I've never really asked for them or received them so I don't yeah. Okay. Leave her. Bye. Take care. <laughs>